Hey, welcome to a new video tutorial by Crocfix. And uh, today we have here an older Huawei P Smart Z phone and actually also a new Samsung Galaxy A05s phone. And we want to transfer all data from the old phone to the new phone here. So I'm gonna do a little bit nicer screen here so you can see. All right, so firstly, to transfer all data from the old Huawei to the new Samsung, let's go and click and choose the language on the new phone. So I'm gonna choose English here. Then you click next. You must agree the end user license agreement. Click on agree. Okay, easy setup with another device. Uh, we're gonna click now on setup manually. Firstly, you need to connect to your Wi-Fi. So let's go and connect to your Wi-Fi. All right, click on next. Getting your phone ready, just wait a little bit. All right, now you will see copy apps and data. So we will come to this. Let's go and click here on next. Use your other device. This is our other device. Click on next. All right, get started with Samsung uh, smart switch, with smart switch. All right, let's click on next. We need to allow all here, all stuff. Select a source, what's your old device? It's an Galaxy Android, all right? So uh, here it says uh, get connected. How do we want to connect? Click on cable. I want to use just the cable now. So we are going to plug in the cable here in the new phone. Let's plug in the USB-C. And let's go plug in also into the USB-C of the phone. It's a little bit weird here on my side because I just have a screen here connected because the old one was broken. Never mind. Here, uh, click on transfer files. Um, no installed apps work with USB accessory. Learn more, blah, blah, blah. We can click on view now here. All right. Click on view. All right, it doesn't matter. So once we are connected here, then we will do following. Just click here and go into the main menu. And then just a second, I will just make the picture nicer. Now you click on Play Store. Let's go into the Play Store on your old phone. In the search, click Smart Switch. Uh, click, I mean, you need to write down Smart Switch already okay then you click here on this application from samsung like on this icon here and you click on install so we need to install this app to transfer to the samsung phone you need to wait here to for this to complete all right So it's installing. Okay, installing. Okay, now we click on open. And we go down here on continue. Then we go down here and click continue. We need to allow here, allow, 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 allow allow 
to use smart switch you need to turn on usage data access in settings click settings click here on allow usage access and then go back all right smart switch allow smart switch okay we allow and now transfer your data let's go we click on cable all right and here on the old one we see a message your connection to your old phone was lost reopen smart switch to try again okay it's checking info So if it didn't work, don't worry, just skip this, skip, here we go and accept. You can choose your browser engine, click on next. If you want to protect your phone, I'm just going to skip now, skip anyway. Please wait. Recommended apps. I don't need any recommended apps now. I'm just gonna go back and click next here. Forgot password or don't have an account. Set up later in settings. Skip. Here I can click on agree and next. You are all set up, click on finish. And then we're gonna go here. Uh, you go up here and then you click on settings. And then you will go down and click to accounts and backup. And then you click here on backup data, restore data now smart switch you see here smart switch bring data from all device click on bring data from all device this will open smart switch so transfer your data i want to receive data your battery is low we need to charge it a little bit mm -hmm, all right just click on galaxy android okay and click on cable here again all right, connecting to transfer your data. So the cables are connected, get connected. We can unplug the cable and plug it in again. There we go. This will make the connection here. It didn't work, let's try again, turn out on the old phone and insert it again. If it didn't work, don't worry. Just close all the apps, disconnect the phone. Let's go back again, search for smart switch and go again. Let's go, cable and insert the cable again. Okay, if this is not working, just does, doesn't matter. Go back, go back also here. And we will click now on wireless. Disconnect Wi-Fi for faster transfer, disconnect. And we click also on wireless here. Cancel. We need to turn on Wi-Fi, okay. So the phone will send a sound, they recognized each other already. Invitation, connect to Galaxy A5, connect. Now it's looking for all the data here. So we just use the Wi-Fi transfer then. So it asks us what we want to transfer, we select everything, then we click on next, transfer your accounts, if you know your password, click here or here and transfer, 
I'm gonna skip this and I click next here to transfer everything. So I got a message here that this will take around one hour and eight minutes. So just leave your phone and when it's done, when it comes to 100%, you will see here a message transfer completed and then you can wait a little bit. You will uh, hear all stuff will be arranged. You will see here transferring, later you will see arranging uh, files. It must come to 100%. And when it's done, once, just one time, restart the phone and that's it. Maybe in some apps you will to re-enter your Gmail and password, but otherwise, uh, I mean, you will have all data from the old phone to the new phone. That's it. Uh, let me know in the comments if it did work for you, if you find the video helpful, if you want to say thank you, or if you have any other thoughts. Thanks for watching. If the video did somehow help you, then you can buy me a coffee. Donations are always appreciated. Thank you. You find the donation link in my about page and in the video description. Please also like, comment and share the video. And please don't forget to subscribe to my channel.